Well, all right, everybody. Well, welcome to our first attend. And as Lossie mentioned, we have Dolphinet, who is a Raiden, Raiden. loyalist, um, versus Frost. Dario, who has been playing a lot of Frost. Um, <clears throat> so this should be an interesting matchup with some characters that we don't see that often comparatively. Indeed. So it should be a lot of fun, and uh, ho hopefully you guys are all excited. We're excited to see what's yeah. going to happen here. I'm They're excited to Belgium. learn some things about Raiden. Oh, yeah. This is the first... Yeah, the variation that everyone uses of Raiden. Yes. <laughs> Yadze says, Molly, keep it PG. Yes, Yadze, I'm going to be good. Um, PG? I, I got a little <laughs> upset sometimes during my stream the other day, Lofty, and there oh, was some, some yelling, and there was a bit of cursing. <laughs> I must admit, and it's some scorpion, so... <laughs> oh, why did I miss I'm that? I'm going to be good. <laughs> I'm going to be good. Fight. Oh, thank you so much for the resale voucher. 12 months, oh my gosh. No, 30 months. Thank you so much. Alright, so we've got... Dalton is playing Thunder Wave, so... The question is this is the variation that I am most familiar with. I feel like this is the one that is the most commonly played. Like what um, Drew says? Don't talk my uh, storm cell. My storm cell, yes, exactly. <laughs> Oh. All right. So Dario is uh trying to be careful and spacing out exactly how to get in on Raiden here. Frost can be pretty dangerous if she gets you trapped in the corner, but Raiden does have that teleport in Thunder Wave, and it actually is quite fast. Um, so it can be a little bit difficult to keep him trapped anywhere. Oh, the oh, all right. Oh, good oh, teleport, teleport there. Cancel. Nice cancel. Ah, that's blocked back. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there we go. Blow. The storm cell. Wow. Blow. It was a really great comeback from uh, that. So just, just as you were saying, Lofty. <laughs> Will not duck my storm cell, and there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Dolphin had told me day one, hey Lassie, you can duck the storm cell. I was like, huh? <laughs> so thank you, Dolphin, for sharing that. Let's see, again, here we go with uh, those Raiden teleports, and you can see that Raiden teleport is quite fast and doesn't yeah. seem to have much in the way of recovery, so it is an extremely useful tool. Again, Raiden a character that's not played that much, so I feel as though uh, his teleport is not something that really is discussed that often. Certainly not in the vein of some other teleports like Cetrion Indeed. or, of course, of or course Scarlet. Scorpion. Oh yeah, <laughs> Scorpion. Oh. Oh, I think so much, Steven, to give the subs. I really appreciate it. All right, now we've corner, got Dario doing some dangerous. damage here at the corner. Gotta keep the pressure on to make sure that uh, nice Raiden trip. can't teleport his way out of there. Oh, oh there he nice. goes, but nice right into a good punish. Did you see that coming? Yeah, I think that was Fine. Really Yeah. Fight. Ooh, nice. Right. Yeah, I'm learning things, like I corner. just picked up Frost, so this is really nice to see. Yes, it'll be- I don't have much experience with Frost either playing her or playing against her, so uh, it, it's good you've got some background here on her yeah, lobby to indeed. provide us with. And that is really good, uh, Frost player. Mm. Oh, again, that fast teleport oh. into the overhead. He tried to go for the push and go, but he blocked it. Nice, oh, good throw save. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, and it's in the storm cell again. Yeah. <laughs> the overhead. Oh, ah, there and there's it is. that crushing blow. Into another storm cell. I think this. <gasps> oh, no, he drops it. So. Ah! But... Oh! oh! Amazing the throw attack. Grab. Perfectly timed at the end. Wow. Alright, oh, so Jaro comes back at the very last second to save himself with a perfectly wow. timed uh, throw escape. Wow, that was really, really good. Extremely I strong was first going match. For the comeback. He was almost there. Yeah, he was extremely close there. I honestly yeah. thought that he had it, but uh, uh, just 
very well read uh throw escape there by Dario to yeah. take back that uh take back his lead in the end and uh take that first match. So extremely strong first match from both of these players. Yes. Super clutch. How can you tech grab? I still don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like some days I'm doing really well with tech grabs and I'm very successful and then other days I can't do any at all. So I'm, I'm not at a position where I'm consistent with it yet and some people are just amazing at it. Yeah, I really want to learn that. Like yeah. whenever I tech grab, it's an accident. Hey, yeah. you changed! You changed variation! Region? Oh, alright. Or the other one. So this, it seems yeah, to be, yep, went with Ragin. I All right, so, really don't uh, know anything about this variation. Dolph is gonna switch things up here a little, and uh, mm. this could actually be partially because of the fact that this is a less familiar variation. Yeah. Uh, Smart. Maybe he got a sense that, that Dario was pretty comfortable uh, with Thunderwave at this point. Yep. Um, Dario was reading some of those teleports, so this might be a better Crushing opportunity. Blow. Ooh, yeah. but the crushing blow into a nice big combo. Ooh, nice. Nice pressure? Wow, nice back blow. Alright, so one thing about uh, Raiden is he does have some extremely strong and fast moves. So again, Raiden is a character in, in most variations who has some serious weaknesses, but in Raiden he is able to really put down a lot of pressure. Um, so once he's got you trapped in that corner there, it can be a difficult situation. Mm. Yeah, it's a low. Ah, he gets that, I think. He can charge it up. He gets charged up. Okay, good uh, dive and attack by Dario there. Ooh, nice oh, nice anti-air. But goes right into the anti-air grab. Oh. Good breakaway, but goes straight so back into the grab. Yes, I understand that paid. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. So Dario went for a nice little uh, oh, yeah. pop attack, which could have been useful, but it was read by Dolphin, went right into the fatal blow. What a smart finisher. Uh, GG, guys. Alright, so a strong comeback with the switch to Ragin by Dolph, and now we are tied up one and one. Yeah, Staring Bay says, those mix-ups, damn, Raiden. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, again, a variation we don't see uh, that often, so I think no. not a ton of us are super familiar with this, but uh, he does seem to have quite a few possibilities in this variation. Mm -hmm. And I do understand why a lot of people tend to go uh, with Thunder Wave, because, as we were saying, that teleport is so fast and <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> And Storm it's Cell, so which strong. we all love so much at this point. But uh, Raijin is a very uh, strong variation to go with, so it's fun to see. Indeed. I'm still curious how it works. So maybe this time Daddy was gonna adapt and he understands it a bit better? Yes, we shall see. Has electric current, electric burst, quick charge. Mm. Round one, fight. All right, so an immediate uh, dive in right off the bat. Yeah, use is very good. I'm gonna use it then. It's one of those moves that you have to be extremely careful of because of how unsafe it can be. But yeah, true. if you can space it out accurately, uh, can be quite a threat from a pretty large distance so that your opponent has to be on edge and careful whatever they do. They can't just be caught throwing out projectiles at you. Yeah, that's true. Mm. Alright, so don't getting himself wow, out of the corner and again with that anti-air grab. Now that is a very useful tool to have Ooh, in this game. Attack. Oh. Yeah, that's one of the strengths of Dolph. He knows how to flawless block. A lot of things. Round two, fight. I was going to say, teach me your ways, Dolph, but uh, <laughs> <Yeah>. for those <laughs> of you who know Steve. Gab, um, <laughs> Gab gave a uh, uh, lesson on using the lab, and uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> some of us were more diligent students than others. <laughs> and I obviously have not gone into the lab since this time. <laughs> 
Yeah, hopefully soon we're gonna do it. Ooh, they're down too. Nice dive one. Ooh, Ooh another fire. big combo. Changing projectiles, doing the best to kind of just keep him out here. He does as a teleport. Oh. All right. Oh, it's and hard. This is hard to get in. Yeah, very much so. Frost actually, I feel like uh, her ability to zone is is um, something that a lot of people don't really discuss that much. She actually can be a very strong zoning character if she needs to be. True. Yeah, that's what I've been doing with her too. I'm especially afraid of blow <laughs> full screen. Yeah. <laughs> One of the best fatal blows in the yes. game for certain. <laughs> And of course, Frost being another character that uh, isn't played a huge amount online, um, but so I think that, like Raiden, she's a character that people aren't particularly familiar with a lot of her tools, um, but she has quite a bit in her arsenal if you give her the opportunity. Indeed. I've noticed that. Oh, they both have their fatal blows. Alright, so again, Dario being smart and just trying to zone yeah, out Dolph here, really smart, and yeah. successfully get to end up taking the match. But exactly as we've seen, um, without the teleport there isn't that much that Raiden can do to try yeah. and get in once Frost is throwing out her projectiles. So it was a good decision maybe switching to Raiden originally because Dario didn't seem as familiar, um, and it has some very useful tools with pressure, but just as you predicted, Losty, uh, Dario was able to adapt quite quickly and using those projectiles yeah. take this match to go ahead 2-1. to one. Yeah, Dolph really struggled with the uh, zoning. His projectile is too slow to do something about the frost. projectiles of Frost. Wait, did oh he yes, change? absolutely. I think he's sticking with Raijin. Ooh, he's Special gonna give it another try. Okay, Let's I'm curious see. what he's gonna do. Yeah. Yep, sticking. He's gonna give it another chance. Yeah, I'm curious now. Um, so I saw somebody in the chat was asking if Losty and I are in the same room, and nope, we're actually in- we're in totally different countries, but we are in a- a PS4 party, so... Um... Does it sound like it? Yep. We're in the same room. I mean, that's that's good. It sounds like we're in the same room. Yeah, perfect quality. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe someday. Someday Lossie's gonna visit New York and then we'll be in the same yeah, room. Yeah, definitely. So. My bucket list. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, good breakaway. That's oh, and a, and a nice cancel. Oh, that range on Frost that she has. So that's a very uh, punishable move that she has that lunge, but if she can actually utilize it to her advantage, it, it has such range. Indeed. Oh, you tried to get out of the corner. But at least now he's not there anymore. Yes. <laughs> Start off the second round uh, in a much better place than yeah. he ended the first. So. Indeed. Alright, another cancel. Just trying to do whatever he can to kind of keep good spacing against Frost, but again, as I was saying previously, her range is so, so huge that it's very yeah. difficult to kind of figure out exactly where to put yourself where you can harm her but not be in danger. Yeah. And now with those projectiles, um, so Dario goes for a dive-in. I'm not sure if that was necessarily what I would have done in that situation, since it seems like the zoning has been working out pretty well, yeah, but he's trying to was hoping to try and get him in the corner. Oh yeah, or that. Alright, so both being very cautious when they're right in each other's faces, knowing that either one of these characters can lay down Whoa, the pressure. Nice. But, oh, a good anti-air! Well, Alright, and now experience. Dario's in the corner. Alright, so a strong comeback that round by Dolph to tie it up Final and take us to round three. Fight. Oh. Now Dario wants to get him in the corner. Swear yes, Dario didn't want to be stuck in that corner going with some of those strong jump-ins that Frost has and now putting down a lot of pressure. Nice 
Oh, Ooh. he did a punish. All right, but missed the punish, so, and now a reversal throw, so we've exchanged positions here. Yep. Dario's trying to get back out of the corner. He also goes in for some pressure, but gets hit for it. Wow, that's not as well. Oh, that projectile. All right, and now back into the spacing game, throwing out the projectile. Oh, but again, goes in for a uh, jump in, which... That uh, chip damage chip. from Frost is gonna end the round. Yeah, again, I wasn't sure why he necessarily went for the dive in at that moment, since he could have seemingly zoned him out, but I think perhaps again it was a situation of wanting to, to get himself out of the quarter just in case. Mm. Um, and the chip damage from Frost ended up working out for him. <laughs> Dario says, okay, how did that not punish? Yeah, that's what we were kind of wondering about yes. there, Dario. Um, it definitely seemed like it should have. Hey, hey Mark. Mark, hi! Good to see you. Serang Bay says, this Raiden, whoa! And Dario's Frost, of course, is fantastic. Yes. The We're both playing again. extremely strong uh, today. And he sticks with Raiden again. Yes, as you said, Rossi, the more? Raiden no. loyalist. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not sure, Suffering I think he did through. pretty good with Thunderwave. Yeah, I do think that Thunderwave uh, seemed to be working out very well, and you know, maybe it's just... Maybe he feels more he comfortable. He feels like this. he's more comfortable, yeah. exactly. <laughs> but we'll see, you know, maybe he'll end up switching back uh, in the future. We've still got maybe. quite a few matches ahead of us, I think. Yeah, it's 3 to 1 for the batting. <laughs> and kind of a double jumping situation, they knock each other back out. <laughs> It can't do much damage in this variation. Alright, a wake up there by Dario to get something going. Alright, now throwing out those projectiles, trying to take as much damage as possible from a distance. And here again oh, we have an know. example of Frost really just yeah, excellent that's really ability to keep the back out. Oh! Alright, so, uh... Dolph was going for the anti-air, but Dario actually <gasps> went low and oh, only tried for Fatal Blow! Alright, so that was a very strong performance that round by Dario all the way through, laying down a lot of pressure, but um, at the end, Dolph is gonna come back with that Fatal Blow and, and take that round. Round two, fight. Where will I make channel points useful? I don't know how it works. I should look into it. What would you guys like to see for channel points? Yeah, what choices are there? I haven't checked them. Um, there's a few options. I know that you can do things like uh, put options for people to have uh, first to ten matches against you or to request what character you might use. Oh. Um, there's options to unlock emotes for free and Oh, okay. A lot of different choices. Yeah, I'm gonna check it out uh, into it this week. Oh, another good jump in. Uh, the into a bunch of pressure. Oh, oh he saw that coming. goes for the grab and gets spread into the crushing blow. Good breakaway though to potentially save it. Oh, and a uh, down two. Yeah. And sure that's an interesting taunt. Be. I don't think I've seen that frost taunt before with the kind of glowing eyes there. Oh wait, this is. Oh. No. oh. And that's another crushing blow that I I don't see that often. Indeed, I can never do that one. Ooh, smart jump. Oh. This is a down two, and now we're back with that crazy frost chip damage. And now we're back facing each other out. Dario going with those projectiles. Oh, into a dive Ooh, kick, but punish. no punish. All right, so here's an opportunity oh, for Dolph, but a good breakaway. Oh, and just ah, he's out of the corner. Just dives his way out yeah, of the corner. That's what he wanted. 
Oh, goes for the anti-air, but uh, Dario didn't end up jumping. Projectiles again, and this could be it. Yep. All right. So Dario doing a very good job in this matchup of kind of reading when it is that Dolph needs to get in and uh, just backing off and trying to apply as many projectiles as pressure. Uh, uh, Ugh, excuse me. <laughs> as many projectiles as possible. Um, and he, like, whenever he gets cornered, there's always a way he finds out to go back to the mid screen and keep uh, Dolph in the corner. Yes, doing a very good a job of uh, escaping when yeah. necessary. Frost. Raiden. All right, so it looks like Dolph is Ooh, considering, no. but he's going to stick with Raiden. <laughs> All right, so again, you they know, did as I will see, uh, Thunderwave does have that teleport, so I could see how he might consider going back to it, mm. but, you know, just as you said, he, he definitely seems to be adapting as we go along um, yeah. and improving in this matchup, so he wants to keep giving it a shot, and I think that's that's a good idea. Daria has a really nice uh, reach. So Sarang Bay is saying Dario is making me want to pick up Frost again. We you should. should! Just like me. Oh wait, our plan was to Jade, right? But then. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So I was streaming when I was streaming, uh, I ended up playing Jade quite a lot and Dad was there and he was he was disgusted, so <laughs> he was very disappointed in all the Jade presents. <laughs> <laughs> The knockdown for Jack was really good. Nice, duck wall. Alright. Yeah. Oh, and into the fatal blow. Alright. So one of the things of that Dolph has been doing a, a very good job of in these matches is utilizing his fatal blow was kind of the perfect timing to take some of these rounds when he was otherwise very far behind. Mm. Yet again you fail. Round two fight. All right, so again, just trying to face each other out as much as possible. But again, as you had mentioned, a situation where if if they're from a distance, this really does benefit Frost. Um, and that could be something that Dolph isn't particularly used to because Raiden in Raiden does have the ability to uh, to play the space game and really attack you from a distance. So this mm. could be something that he's not used to being the one that's uh, having to try and fight his way in. Indeed. Oh, wow, and goes right into that good. projectile and the down Very strong too. round for him, for Dario. Final round, fight. Ah, by the low. Oh. Well, what happened there? But <laughs> notice that Dolph keeps uh, going for the anti-air, anticipating that Dario is going to jump, but Dario is just not seemingly falling for it very much. No. They're reading each other very good. Alright, so again, some more careful spacing, both of them being very cautious. He's in the corner. Oh, right, this, this is gonna be a lot of damage. That Dolph does not want to be in right now. Oh, good breakaway, break but... But that's that grab! So nice! Oh. Alright, and that with this combo, that's gonna be it. So Dario's gonna take this match again and finish it off with a pretty, pretty big combo in the quarter, just kinda showing off a little yeah. bit there. <laughs> showing what he Always can do. Always finish it. So now it's 5 to 1 for Dario. Alright, so again. Kind of, kind of as we've seen in some of our other first attempts as well, we see the score and it looks as though Dario is, is fairly far up on Dolph, but all of these matches have been quite close, a lot going to round three mm. and solid performances by both of them in pretty much every round, so... Indeed. Raiden. Okay, Frost. now he's going back to Thunderwave. 
All right, I think that this could potentially be a good decision. decision. Um, he's he's done everything that he could to try and kind of dance around Frost, feel his way in, but uh, that teleport might be necessary at this point. Very useful. We could bring back our beloved Storm Cell. <laughs> teleport. Oh, I, I remember in Dent plays Raiden and then Thunder Wave, but teleporting makes me. Oh god, yeah. Fight. Teleport into teleport into downward yeah. of the storm cell. <laughs> into grab. And cancel, of course. Teleport cancel. Wait, cancel? No, amplified. Yeah. Oh, oh you and, and great job ducking under that in order to switch position. Ooh. That was a risky jump in, but ended up working out uh, in Dario's favor. Again, just doing a very good job with uh, those dive ins. Break away, stop the combo. Flawless blocks there. And again, with the flawless blocks, so consistently, not yeah. like me. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, good teleport to put himself out of the corner. But again, now we have a throw, switching positions. Nice that short hop so to get into the combo. This is going to be a lot of damage. Oh, but a breakaway into the teleport, giving himself an opportunity here. Wow, he really got a Oh, I am wow. I didn't even know there was a bonus button. Alright, and corner. a big grab to put him right back into the corner. Oh, that read! That read was really and good. the storm cell. Yeah. A good breakaway to prevent the full storm cell damage. <laughs> there would be a lot of damage. <laughs> oh, oh, you red dead! For the grab, red into the down two, and now another big frost combo is coming. Wow, almost 200 damage. All right, here come those projectiles, but he's got to keep in mind that Dolph does have the teleport now. Oh, dangerous place. All right, so Dolph has a fatal blow ready. Has to be careful, though. Frost has a ton of pressure here. Oh, and there he goes into the grab. And a pretty uh, strong match there yeah. uh, for Dario. Dario really has nice reads. I'm really curious if he know, if he loved the matchup. I remember Dolph said he played against him sometimes. Yeah, it definitely does seem as though uh, he was prepared yeah. prepared for taking on Raiden. Certainly more prepared than I think most of us would be, considering yeah, you don't have a huge amount of Raidens out there in Combat League I or wish. really anywhere. <laughs> I wish to they were there. Experience. <laughs> Instead of the scorpions. Raiden. Instead of all of the billions of scorpions and sub zeros and Liu Kangs, you know, yeah. all the familiar faces. Aaron <laughs> of Dragon Grotto. <laughs> so Yonsei says, Dan, are you ready for all the jades <laughs> in the next YouTube members call? <laughs> and Dan says, Sorry, not joining that. <laughs> but <Yeah>. Dan <laughs> <laughs> it's specifically for you. And is it okay if we customize it like the way you want? <laughs> yeah. That's a good deal, right? <laughs> yeah, I think so. <laughs> I love this customization. Whoa, that was a really nice back walk, Dario. Alright, so Dolph has gone back to Ragin. It seems like uh, he felt a little more comfortable with this variation, even though he's gonna have to do more work getting in. It seems maybe this is just where he feels best. Yeah. Oh, again, good diving. Oh, oh, and the crushing blow again into a combo, and that's gonna take Whoa. that round. Yeah. Round two. Sario with a really strong round there. And now, on top of that, he's got Dolph trapped in the corner, and this is going to be difficult to get out of. This is going to be... Oh, I learned this one because of Dario. The corner combo so good. 
Dario sharing his wisdom with us. Yeah, indeed. Alright, facing each other carefully. Dolph realizes he's gotta make up quite a bit of damage here. Here's his opportunity for a punish. Mm, he dropped it. Ah, oh, that's a punish. Alright, and into the crushing blow. Okay, but now he's gonna deal with those projectiles, try to get in again. We're both in fatal blow <gasps> territory. Oh, I forgot about that! Misses, but <laughs> he's so far away that there's no opportunity wow. for a punish on that miss fatal blow. But really, it really was really good. I think it was gonna grab him. Oh, oh it's so close! Oh. And again, one of the strengths of Frost, that fatal blow, that even though Dario ends up uh, missing the fatal blow, Raiden is so far away that there's yeah. literally nothing that he can do in response to punish that, so Frost was basically a uh, safe, <laughs> safe fatal blow. Wow. <laughs> so happy whenever I use her, I'm like, yes, I can just stand on full screen. <laughs> Unless like you're against... Jade. <laughs> oh yeah, that's true. That's oh yeah, indeed. I I was like, yeah, I'm gonna uh, hit her with the fatal blow, and then she the the purple glow, and, and then I did it. I didn't hit her, and I was like, huh? Oh, oh. <laughs> frost. Jade is so interesting. She's just one of those characters where uh, she has Special some very bad matchups, but it also seems like there's certain matchups that she was made specifically for. Yeah. So she's very much a utility character, and uh, I think good for anybody to have is kind of like a secondary or backup in oh, yeah, those just plan. in case those bad matchups. Scorp. Yes, oh, exactly. <laughs> pocket scorpions, pocket emerald defender jades, you know, just just for everyone's enjoyment. <laughs> Wait, Dan is saying what? Superman can't punish? The fatal blow, Dan. A uh, frost. Oh, interesting. Uh, that's possible, Dan. We'll have Didn't to ask... We'll have to ask Dolph uh, when they're finished, if no. that's something that you can do. <laughs> nice punish. Alright, ah. so the Jaded Variation can straight up oh, run towards you with Purple Glow against Frosted Arrow and Fatal Blow. Yes, yes, Jaded is uh, definitely good at punishing. <laughs> punishing those <laughs> Fatal Blows. And again, when she gets you in that corner, Frost can be extremely dangerous. And uh, Dario's oh, doing hops. an excellent job with those short hops. Yeah. Kinda like a mix up. Oh, and uh, some good kind of dancing around spacing yeah. there from Dolph to go into the ground all and uh, keep himself alive. <laughs> oh, but now he's got to contend with all of these projectiles, and the chip might do it. Yes, oh. and it does. All right. It's a dangerous situation to get into when you have someone with fast projectiles like that. There's really not anything he can do because uh, she can just chip him out. I haven't seen Superman grab. at all today, I think. Yeah, honestly, I haven't yeah. either. I know it's it's kind of a dangerous, yeah, punishable move, safe. but seems like there might be some uh, situations here where it could be warranted. But nice then again, level. frost projectiles are so fast that maybe uh, Dolph feels like there's no way it would actually be successful. True. There's gonna be a lot of damage. All right, now we've got fatal blow risk from both Whoa. of them. Oh, all mm. right. Final round, fight. So a good job by Dolph taking that round and uh, managing to save his fatal blow as well. Oh, oh my god. Ah, <laughs> uh, so that's why he's not using it anymore. Uh huh. <laughs> oh, Dan. Then we have you for that, okay? <laughs> Dan, this is your job. You provide. <laughs> <laughs> the information we're not sure about. Listen, Dan, you play like these random Nightwolf variations and characters like Raiden that no one knows. So, I mean, you, you gotta help us out here. <laughs> Can't expect people to know anything about Raiden. <laughs> He's barely even in the game. Yossi's saying, can't wait for Dan to come to Terry with Lost. Oh. <laughs> That's random. 
Stop roasting me. <laughs> Ooh, nice cancels. Wait, is he going to do a comeback? All oh, right, so this would be a big comeback uh, if oh, Dario could pull it off. Oh, but him. Dolph is saying, no, no, you're not taking this one from me. This is mine. That was a strong play of uh, Dolph. All right, so yeah, so very solid performance again by both of them. Um, and Dolph continuing to uh, get a better handle on this matchup yeah. and how to kind of work his way around all the tools that Frost has. Yeah, he's definitely feeling more comfortable. Mark says Raven's wave dashing looks weird. <laughs> yeah, it's interesting to see. I I've feel like we're learning quite a bit about Raiden right now that uh, we weren't familiar with. I mean, except Dan, but uh, I mean, Dan. Yeah, he's a special No one but you knows Raiden, so. Yeah. Dan used to play Raiden a lot. Yeah, yeah Dan, why don't you play him anymore? Because he's bad? He likes bad uh, workers, right? <laughs> Low tier. <laughs> Low tier? <laughs> yeah. Ooh, the crushing blow. Alright, so again, slowly working his way in while throwing out those projectiles for some damage at the same time. Put him in the corner. The grab. And a grab. Hey, Tossing him changed. out of the corner. Uh, he, I thought but he again. was going to think he's going uh, to the back grab. Dad's saying, yeah, I still play him just when I feel like it. I've been feeling like playing Nightwolf uh, recently. Yeah, you noticed that. Uh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the hard play. <laughs> Everyone don't like I mean, Nightwolf now because of them. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Ooh, not that we can slave you, Dan. It does seem like Nightwolf is a stronger character choice than Raiden, but uh. <laughs> All right, so so far, a uh, very strong round here for Dolph. Um, yeah, Dolph is standing now more at a distance. Reversed, exactly. We've got a little bit of a reverse situation yeah. here where Dario is the one trying to make his way in. Alright, but now we know how dangerous and uh, damaging Frost can be in the corner, so wow. pretty quickly this the is almost, almost even. Alright, um, and there we go, there's our Superman. There we go, <laughs> everyone. <laughs> Final oh yeah, <laughs> finally. You saw that then? The second one? <laughs> Did you click that fashion contest between me? Oh no, I forgot! Yeah, Molly weren't there. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna send him a bit later. Oh, we had a... Uh, we had a standoff, a fashion, fashion standoff, yeah. <laughs> between Bathia and Molly. Uh, Molly. Oh, well, this is then. pretty exciting. <laughs> You're gonna love it. I laughed so hard. <laughs> Oh, in the corner. Pushing himself out. Oh. And a wake up. Alright, and now Dario's gonna try and space him out again. Dolph is really As patient. He gets close, he has to watch out for that fatal blow. Ooh, the grab. Oh. oh, and walks into the projectile. Again, trying to get in, he ends up getting caught. Just such a difficult position to be in against yeah, Frost. Especially when she has the life leader, so he has to uh, get in. So <laughs> now it's 8 for Dario to... to Imagine supposedly being a god and protector of an entire realm and being one of yeah, the Yeah, that combatants. sucks. That Yikes. really sucks. And we're to yeah, the same thing. Poor Raiden. Yeah. <laughs> He deserves some more love. Just, uh, but you never know. Seems like an NRS just wants Raiden to work hard. <laughs> oh wait, in the end of the story he wasn't a god anymore, guys. It's true, he's <laughs> really? just an average human now, yeah, everybody. Like, so. <laughs> Liu Kang is, a, is the god now. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, we can see that there is a gate there already. Forward force, all you need. Fire the gate again. <laughs> Now wait a minute, so Mark is saying it was uh, between you and Bontian's collector, so this was a collector fashion off, is what we... Uh, no, it was in um, Baraka fashion oh, off. Oh, Baraka, okay, <laughs> so a even better! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so Delph is gonna continue to uh, stick with Rage in here. Yeah, you doing a good job. Seem to be Getting getting a little bit of a better feel for Frost with every every match. Mm. But again, these are two Watch characters that I don't feel tremendously familiar with, so I'm not sure. And maybe uh, people who are more used to them in the chat, I don't know, Dan or anybody else uh, who plays Raiden or Frost, could tell us. Is this matchup generally just a bad one for Raiden to deal with? Um, not even just in this variation. Yeah, is is Frost a difficult character for him? It just says, well, there were multiple characters Baraka, Noob, Collector, and Cetrion. Oh, yeah! Yeah, but Baraka was the highlight then. to make Cetrion look bad? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's a difficult feat! Ooh, the projectile at the end. <laughs> okay, so Dan says, I think Frost Round is just difficult two. in general. And uh, Steven says, Why I think Frost has the upper hand to get raided. Ah. Alright, so it does, I mean, it makes sense to me based on what we've seen so far, because uh, Dalt is having to work extremely hard here in all of yeah. these matchups in order to deal with Frost. Uh, and yeah, Dad, I do think that Frost has a pretty wide toolkit, so it makes sense to me that she would be a fairly difficult character to deal with, but then that brings us back to Lofty's question of why don't we see her that often? Uh, maybe it's just another one of those instances of people not really trying out a character. Maybe underrated? Or hard to use? Yeah, either one of those could be possible. Yeah. And the chip. Yeah, the chip is insane. Oh, don't try to get in. Ooh. He still has his fatal blow. Ah. Oh, and he goes for it, but ends up getting the, chipped uh... out at the end. Alright, so another strong round here from uh, Dario, and that's gonna bring us up to 9 2. Could be the match uh, point. Hey, Jimmy, All right, so what's up? Dream, hello my love, good to see you. Oh, and, and Dream has some new emotes, everyone. So for those of you that haven't seen, she's Ooh, putting in the Tanya. chat right now, along with her Melina, she's got a Tanya who's Sonia. being patted on the head by Melina, which is perfect. And then yes, a Sonia. She also has gotten herself a Cassie, a oh. Cetrion, and a Frost. So nice. perfect timing. I haven't seen a frost uh, emote yet. I know, like almost no one has Should a frost I emote. So, um, Raiden Dan is saying Raiden doesn't have a good range mid, and Dario's always standing outside of Raiden's reach. Yes, mm -hmm. yes, he's doing a very good job of spacing him out there. Um, but Steven is also saying people just don't like Frost uh, as a character. Um, and I think that's why not many people play her, which is certainly possible. That is something that, you know, we do see some of the more popular characters tend to get played no matter how strong or weak they are. Yeah, I'm happy that I picked her up because now I can see her strength. And I'm learning a lot. Absolutely. Oh, and Lofty Dream has put uh, all those new emotes in the chat if you would like to check them out. They are very oh! adorable. Oh, they are so cute. Oh my gosh. I really like the Frost one. Oh. I think her Kathy looks so cute with the little bubble gum. Yeah. But personally, out of the new ones, I'm preferential to Tanya because Molina is patting her on the head. So. True. That's true. <laughs> Alright, so again, some pretty huge combo damage from Frost, and now we are both in Fatal Blow territory. Fatal Blow. Alright, and Dolph's gonna go for it. Smart decision here. 
to make sure that he can solidly take this first round. Always a good decision if you're in Fatal Blow territory and you can take that round at the beginning of a set, uh, Just get yourself up. Yeah. Ooh, nice question, Bill. Wow. Alright, again, he kind of goes for the anti-air in anticipation, but we don't see, oh, uh, okay. many jumps, uh, from Dario. Dario's doing a good job of, uh, keeping out of reach of that, uh, grab anti-air. Mm. Oh, a short hop, but doesn't quite work out this time, and, uh, Dolph is, uh, in a pretty solid position here. Okay, but now we've got Dario coming back, setting him up in the corner. Alright, Dario's gonna have to work here, but it is possible. Frost can do a lot of damage pretty quickly. Oh, alright, but good pushback there. Dolph keeps himself alive to keep this set going, and now we are 9 and 3. That could be a uh, comeback coming. You never know with Dolph. Yes, you never know. And Dan says a uh, nice conversion by Raiden there, yeah, and indeed. letting Dolph know that he thinks uh, he should use more discharge. I don't know what that means yeah. because I what don't know Raiden's moves, but... <laughs> I see him charging up, I see the electric uh, electricity on his uh, body. <laughs> Yeah. Blowing up more. <laughs> Dad, Dad, you're gonna have to be the total coach here because <laughs> I feel so noob. <laughs> At least I saw it. <laughs> Dario is a pro at the shimmy game, don't you think, Molly? Yes, absolutely. Um, Dario's been doing an yeah, extremely good that. job um, throughout this entire set. Shimmies, short hops, um, spacing out. What are shimmies? Utilizing those those dive kicks into a in a way that actually is helpful and not not just getting completely punished and blown out of the water for it, like we do see sometimes with frost. Again, as we see right here. <laughs> All I know about Raiden is he goes zap and he flies like Superman. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds about right. But um, Gabriel says discharge is like when the thunder comes out of the sky from both sides. Oh, okay, all right. So, so what are we doing at the end, end there, basically? Yeah. Yes. All right, and this is an extremely strong oh. round here by Dolph. Uh, you know, as you said, Lofty, you can't really count him out. Yep, that's Dolph. All right, so Dario's got position change here, backing Dolph into the corner, but Dolph is not having any of it. So he can use the discharge now. He's blown off. Ah. All right, Dan. We'll see if he's going to be taking your advice here. Great rollout for quick position. Ooh. All right, goes for the dive out in order to get out of the corner. Smart. And now Dario throwing out those projectiles. All right, Dolph's yes. gotta be careful of the. Oh, there it down. is. Goes for the fatal blow. Yeah, Dolph still has his fatal blow. All right, this is a difficult position to be in. Dario, oh, gotta be careful. Wow. Oh, and there we nice go. Nice patience All from right. uh, Dolph. Really nice. And again, another very strong match from Dolph to bring us up. A little bit closer again. We are now nine to four. He's adapting really good. Well, okay. He has a moment right. emits electricity around his hands, right? You know that if he blocks three strings with a buff, he can do then the discharge move. But is the discharge safe? Raiden. I find you. What about you? Frost. Lossy, don't put me against Dan in my next Blood first two ten. Yonce is asking that. <laughs> <laughs> Yonce. <laughs> oh, a Dream good one. Is, Okay, so Dream, everyone has some more emotes she hasn't revealed also, and she's saying she's going to show her Lee Mei emote ooh, today. Lee so, ooh, oh, very Lee excited. Mei. Excited, Dream, for you to share that. It's so... I've, I've wow. seen, guys, and it's adorable. A lot of respect, Dream, that you're doing an emote for Lee Mei. Because everyone... Oh, Azuria. Faith, hello. Good to see what? you. Yeah, sure, Fabio. 
a warm up match uh, between Javi and Antonio. Yeah. Nice from the spot. All right. So it really seems like uh, Dolph is kind of getting more comfortable here. Coming across as a bit more aggressive, and maybe this is actually a much more winning strategy against Frost. Um, yeah. He had been playing kind of we'll careful, just feeling everything out, but it seems like kind of taking it to Frost is working in his advantage. Oh, misses the punish there. It's gonna be a lot of damage. Ooh, nice. But there we go. Fade of blow. He has his fade of blow. Oh, okay. Nice but break good breakaway there to yeah. save himself. But he is still stuck in the corner, so let's see what happens. Whoa. Okay. Down for into. Uh, I think it was his down for. Or back for. <laughs> oh, nice day the dream. Sam says the, that electric buff also gives him the nice launcher nice. from the low staff move. Okay. And adds a projectile Ooh. to it. Oh, that's Ooh. what he's been using a lot of times. Ah, uh, corner. Dangerous position. Alright, a good breakaway. And manages to jump out of the corner, and now with the throw, pushes Dario back in. This is gonna be nice difficult to catch up, but it is certainly possible, especially after Whoa. that- Oh, but a good jump! Hop. Whoa, this stunned! I've never seen it before! <laughs> what?! <laughs> Whoa, that was so cool. Alright, so... Dario is now on uh, match point for the set. If he can uh, take this round, he will take the first to 10. So Dolph is going to have to fight his way out of the corner in order to keep himself alive. Putting him in the corner. Wow! Oh, anti -air great anti-air. It was amazing. That strong down three from Frost. Okay, and a well-timed jump there from Dario, wow. and he's going to finish out the first to ten with a very GG, strong guys. round. Alright, so very solid performances from both of them. Um, I think that Dolph did a very good job, especially yeah. over the last uh, last few matches of, of adapting to everything that Dario had been doing, but ultimately mm. um, you know, the combination of, of just Dario's excellent job with spacing with the projectiles, with the shimmies, with those little short hops. And the smart corner games, um, getting out of exactly. there, putting them there back. But really just a fantastic set from both of them. So thank you both so much for yep. uh, showing off your Raiden and your Frost, two characters that we don't get a chance to see that much of. Yep, indeed. Um, so Dolph, uh, that's actually 10, that's yeah. so that's actually the end of the set. <laughs> um. It's down to 4 for Dario. If he sees this... Oh yeah, he sees this. Maybe it would have okay. been smart if you so. went uh, Gyros, I'm thinking all about that. Went with Gyros, yeah, yeah, to just check it out. I wonder what the Gyros Frost matchup is really like. I mean, it certainly would help be helpful when uh, Frost is trying to throw out those projectiles to just yeah, sand trap, trap into all oblivion. day long. Yeah. Trying to hold my feeling out to know what's right. I'll find the best way I think that I might.